Yo, what's going on, everybody, man? We are back with another day of Duelith, another day being charged up, and today we're going to see what's going to happen when we put a draft class of the last 30 first overall picks in one draft class, how the NBA look. It's going to be a dope challenge. So we're here in the year 2022. I'm controlling the Detroit Pistons, and the next draft does not have Victor Wembanyama. It's this. All these players were the uh, first overall pick, and I custom made this draft class. So if you guys want to download it, I, I, I believe it's called... Just type in my username on PSN, I'm Duel. You can download this. So every first overall pick of the last 30 drafts are in this class. We're gonna see can I draft well and win a ring with the Pistons. Before we get into it, man, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel. One of you guys comment this idea. So this is your guys' idea. Comment down more. Y'all are keeping the daily upload streak alive. Let's keep going. So let's actually go over the draft class and uh, I'll show you all the I know ball. I'm gonna do like 100% accuracy with the player in the year. Greg Godin was the first overall pick in 07. Allen Iverson was the first overall pick in 96. LeBron was 03. Kenyon Martin was 2001. Very weak draft class, by the way. Um, Paolo was 2022. Elson Brand was 2000. Yup, he was in the year 2000. Chris Webber was 1994. Tim Duncan was 1997. AD was 20... Um, 2012, John Wall was 2011. Psych, he was 2010. John Wall was, John Wall was, damn it, no! Yes, yeah, he was 2010. He was 2010, for sure, because, yeah. Okay, Markel Fultz is 2017. Uh, Blake Griffin is 2009, because that's the Curry draft. Yup. Derrick Rose was 2000, ha, 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 wait a minute. Dang it. This is, yeah, no, Rose is 08. Kerr, uh, Griffin is 09. Okay, I'm doing good. Ben Simmons is 2016. Dwight Howard is 04. Kate is 2021. Zion's 2019. Now, Kyrie, I believe, is 2011. I'm pretty sure it's 2011 and John Wall's 2010. Okay. Ant Edwards is um for sure 2020. Glenn Robinson was 1995. Carl Anthony Towns. 2015, 02 for Yao Ming, 18 is 2018, Wiggins is 14, Andrea Bargnani is 2006, Joe Smith is 1998, uh, Kwame Brown is 2000, I think it's 2000, I think it's 2000 for him, yeah, 2000, uh, Bogut is 05 or 06, and then Michael Olokandi is 1999, and Anthony Bennett, where's Bennett at? All the way over here. He's of course 2013. I think I went like 28 of 30. Comment down below if I got any wrong. I know ball, that was off the dome. I'm a beast. But now let's keep going. Now I gotta make sure the last time I did this video a couple days ago, I messed up and I had the draft be simulated to the CPU handle it. Not today, draft is gonna be off. The CPU will not draft players, I will draft. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. So we're gonna simulate this one season right here up until the draft, and then I gotta draft correctly. And I I'm probably gonna get like the top five overall picks. The Pistons are pretty bad. Um, and I already know what I'm gonna do. I know who I'm gonna go for. We already have Cade, we have Jaden Ivey. So I'm thinking like AD or someone like a big, or Tim Duncan even, and draft him and see if we can win multiple rings. This is a fun series that, that like, I'm glad that you guys are enjoying it. Comment down any other theme draft you want you wanna see, cause I can do this all day. Uh, man, no, bro, we don't even have a pick. The Pistons don't even have a pick. What is this? Yeah, I'm redoing this because what's the point if I don't have a pick? That was dumb. All right, so I had to re-simulate and uh, we end up not making the playoffs. Yeah, so hopefully we get a good draft pick this time. No, we get a seventh overall pick. I will take that. So Jazz get the first overall pick, Spurs and then Hornets. So now it's time for the draft. I get to actually draft who I want. Let's see my team real quick. We have Cade Cunningham, uh, Bojan, Jaden Ivey. We have a good point guard, shooting guard, a small forward. We need a better power forward. I trust in Duran and Wiseman. So, draft time, let's see how it goes. First overall pick, the Jazz select Allen Iverson. That's actually interesting. So, Allen Iverson and Lloyd Markkinen, interesting, okay. Then the Spurs get Chris Webber, very interesting. I'm surprised LeBron didn't get drafted. The Hornets select LeBron James. Okay, so it's gonna be him and LaMelo. And then Washington, they get Greg Oden. Okay, injuries are off, of course, so his career will not be affected. 
Indiana Pacers get Tim Duncan. That's who I wanted. Definitely wanted Tim Duncan. Um, but Indiana gets him. Houston gets Glenn Robinson. And now it's time for us to dra draft. And uh, let's see who we can get. I want a power forward. I'm thinking Anthony Davis would be the, the right move here. A great defender. Yeah. I'm thinking AD. We don't need John Wall or Derrick Rose or Ben Simmons. Dwight might be a good one. I just think... Let's see. Um, Blake Griffin, no. Yao Ming, nah. I think the highest upside is AD. That's that's a smart choice, and we're, and we're getting him. Let's go. The Nets select Paolo Banquero. Uh, the Zion on the Thunder. There's gonna be some duplicates in this video. Raptors with Kenyon Martin. They got a full team of 6'9 players. The Blazers get Derrick Rose. Dang. So him and Dame Lillard in the backcourt. That'd be interesting. Magic get Elson Brand. Rockets also get John Wall. Then the Nets are gonna have Markel Fultz now as well. Um, so him and Bancaro, I think, are playing together. Blazers with Carl Anthony Towns. So Cat, Derrick Rose, and Damian Lillard is a great trio. Dwight to New Orleans. Yao Ming to Orlando. Uh, ben Simmons to Utah. Ain't no way. DeAndre Ayton also to Utah. So Utah has a, has a stack. Yeah, draft. Wiggins to the Pacers with Tim Duncan now. And then there's a trade. The Clippers end up getting Kyrie Irving, which could work out in real life, honestly, if he went to the Clippers with Kawhi and PG. And Edwards to the Rockets. Thunder get Cade Cunningham. Blake Griffin to the Warriors. I don't know who Boomer is. Kwame to the Lakers. Yes, sir. Joe Smith, Bogut, uh, Bayani, nah, nah. I'm waiting for Anthony Bennett to be drafted. Let's just sim to the NSC. Round two, did he get drafted? Anthony Bennett was the, <laughs> he was the 25th pick of the second round going to Indiana. So a quick recap, the Jazz drafted Allen Iverson. We end up getting AD, but who, who was the biggest winners of the draft? I feel like the, the Jazz low key, cause the Jazz got Allen Iverson. Then they also got, um, Ben Simmons and DeAndre Ayton. So if they all fill out to the potential, that's that's a team to look out for. The Blazers also, though, with Derrick Rose and Carthony Towns. But let's continue. Now the league's going to be interesting. And here's our team. Cade Cunningham, Jaden Ivey, Anthony Davis, and Jalen Duran. That's a good team. I think all around, it's a really good team. What does 2K have at the power rankings? The Celtics as... Yeah, the Celtics first, but they didn't have any good draft picks. Now I'm going to keep duplicate... I'm actually... No, I'm going to... I'm gonna keep duplicates, yeah, because I'm keeping Cade Cunningham. So I have to keep duplicates. Just bear with me. For this video, I have to. Um, but the Hornets are also a good team with KP and LeBron. The Clippers with Kawhi. They lost Paul George with that Kyrie Irving. And then, yeah, the Blazers with Lillard, Anthony Simmons, Rose, Carl Anthony Towns. I really don't see a team better than ours. Like, going through it, I think we have the highest upside. So, hey, let's simulate this first season now. And hopefully we can be in the playoffs. By All-Star break, our record isn't that good. 33 and 27 is kind of bad. Why? So let's see. Kate is averaging 24, 7, and 8. That's good. Ivy with 18 and 8. That's good. AD with 18 and 8. Bro, what's the issue? Even Dern is putting up 13 and 9. So I'm trying to see what the issue is here. We're the sixth seed in the East. So the Hawks are the best in the East and then the Grizzlies are the best in the West. But the Jazz are 36 and 22. I wanna see the Jazz team real quick. I gotta turn off injuries also. Forgot about that, damn. Oh, the, oh bro, the Jazz have James Harden, Lloyd Markkinen, Allen Iverson who's putting up 23 and seven. Um, ben Simmons with 11 and seven. DeAndre Ayton with 10 and, bro, their team is stacked. Yeah, Jazz is gonna be the team to look out for, but okay, hopefully, AD can hurry up and progress and win Rookie of the Year. So Ja wins MVP, 32 and 11. So I, I really see Ja win MVP in these simulations. Chris Webber, Rookie of the Year in San Antonio, 18, 12, and 5. Okay. And then Derrick Rose is sixth man as a rookie with 18 and 5 as well. Um, Giannis, defensive player. All right. Any rookies, all NBA. Yes, Chris Webber, and that's it. No, Tim Duncan and other LeBron James as well. Yeah, how, how, did, how did LeBron do? 21, five and six in Duncan in this era? 18 and 14. All defensive, we have our boy Elton Brand. Don't forget about him. Don't sleep on Elton Brand. He was, if you're a Philadelphia 76ers fan, you love Elton Brand, because he gave you guys Joel Embiid, Ben Simmons. He set y'all up for success. All rookie first team, we have Chris Webber, Duncan, LeBron, Paolo, and AI. And then Anthony Davis, all NBA, all rookie second team. That's good. Are we in the playoffs? No, we're in the play-in as a seventh seed. I want to see the rookie report, though. Who scored the most per game? 
Paulo with 24 and 9. And then Iverson with 23. All right, well, the Magic have a, have a good team, I believe. They drafted Yao Ming. Um, Yao Ming, and they have Marco Fultz already. Elton Brand, so where's Yao Ming at? Oh, he's only a set nine overall. Yeah, they got a lot of big guys on this team. Uh, but I think we could take him. Okay, we didn't take him. We lost. Oh, no, we won it. My fault. So we end off as the seventh seed, and we're going up against the Cavaliers. So the Cavaliers, they didn't draft anyone, but they already have a good team. Yeah, Garland, Mitchell, and Mobley. All right, game by game it. They take game one. 2-0. 2-1. Come on. 2-2. Two, two. You're up 3-2, and we're going to a game seven. All right, let's hop in. If we could take the Cavaliers in round one, we could go all the way. And we win it, man. 129 to 111. Box score. Cade had 37, 10, and 11. Our boy AD, he got 10 and 4. He didn't contribute too much. But hey, every point counts. And yeah, Cade carried us to go up against the Hornets now who have LeBron James. And I feel like that's going to be a tough matchup because he's 85 overall, but he's averaging 22, 6, and 7. And they have LaMelo. So, can we take him? Game one, they take it. 1-1, one, 2-1, one, two, one, two, two. we're up 3-2, come on. Ah, we're going to a game seven again. All right, come on, now we're playing at Charlotte. I think they have the honeycomb arena, or the floor is like honeycomb, um, like for like a hornet, because like hornets and honey. But it's a close game. I'm about to jump in right now, down by three, two minutes left. Yeah, what'd I say? It's a honeycomb floor. Porzingis, and I think LeBron's not in the game. He must have fouled out. Hold on, hold on. Let's make sure he fouled out here. 28 points, no, two fouls. I don't know why he's not in the game. Porzingis for three. Damn. Down by six. Now it's a battle of two tall point guards, both like six, seven, and AD on Porzingis. This is a good matchup here. Set him a screen, good screen. K, pass that up. Pass it off to AD. There you go, good pass. Davis, finish. Oh my God, Porzingis stopped him. Oh, LeBron is in the game. He's wearing number 24, I'm blind. But what's he gonna do? Bojan, look at that defense by Bojan. Yeah, good defense, yes sir. Rozier for three, get three. Damn, Bron just bullied him. And let's go. Six points is manageable, we can make this happen. Ivy, Davis, Davis, left hook. Why are you shooting that? Oh, we're, we're cooked, man. Gotta clamp LeBron. That's the issue. He could create plays. Oh, that has he moved. Oh, why did he shoot that? We got lucky. Okay, we are still alive. Bojan can shoot a three. And, 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 and Davis once again in the paint. You gotta score this time. You got to. Damn, he packed your shit. It's over. It's over. Wow. Yeah, Davis got showed up by Christoph Porzingis. And we lost. LaMelo had 37. LeBron had 31. Davis had six points and seven rees, we were not gonna win that game. So year number one, LeBron and the Hornets stop us and they end up losing to the Celtics and the Celtics win it all. All right, not a bad first year, you know, seventh seed, but next season I'm expecting better. Year number two and Cade's a 94, which is crazy. And then 80's a 88 and we got Nick Claxton on the team. Yeah, so um, what's his face? Wiseman left and we have Nick Claxton on the team. We have a real shot to win a chip, for sure. Yeah, for sure. Also got to keep in mind that this is Cade's last year on contract, so I'm hoping we can keep him. He doesn't leave, because I think this is a championship team. And the goal, of course, is to win multiple rings. Uh, first of all, one, but I'm trying to win like five. I think we could do it. On a side note, man, so like I'm currently fasting as I'm recording this 6 p.m., you know, same day that I, you know, I usually record and upload the same day. Bro, these, I put some on my Instagram. These Airheads, extreme, my fingers, bro. Airhead Extremes, I personally think it's the best candy out in the market, bro. Y'all comment down below, y'all think Airheads is the best one or do you think there's something better? Y'all put me on games there's something better. I'm addicted to these Airhead Extremes. It's, it's you know, it's crazy. I look forward to it every day. And, and it's bad, it's a bad addiction, but. You know, and I go to the gym too, so it's like I'll be eating some before the gym as like a pre-workout almost. Give me some sugar, give me some energy. And, and it's, it's amazing. I would love to get sponsored one day, but there's not, there's no way. Why would they sponsor a 2K YouTuber? But there needs to be a YouTuber that makes their own candy. We got Mr. Beast making chocolate, right? You got Logan Paul and KSI with the drinks. Someone needs to make an actual good candy. I'll get behind it. And our record just completely transforms to become insane. 65 and 17. LaMelo wins MVP. And he has LeBron on the team, which is scary. Uh, Chase Schultz. Okay, Damian Lillard is six man. Oh, wow. He got booted, bro. Yeah, I want to see the Blazers lineup. Did, uh... <laughs> 
Yeah, did uh, what's his face? I'll look at that in a minute. Tim Duncan, Defensive Player of the Year, 20 to 16 is nuts, bro. What? And Ben Simmons, Most Improved. Okay, so both Anthony Davises are all NBA third team. Okay, but we finish off as the first seed in the Eastern Conference. I want to see. Were we the best in the league? Absolutely. I like that's that's what I love to see that, bro. But I want to see the Blazers lineup. Is Derrick Rose a starting point guard? And yeah, Lillard's coming off the bench. And they have Shaden Sharp, uh, Carl Anthony Towns. They got a good team, but hey, let's see what the play in. And I want to see how much our boy averaged. Cade got 27 and 10. That's a career best. And then AD with 21 and 9. And then Claxton with only six points and eight reads. What happened here? I, I think Dern might be starting because he have, he's averaging 16 and 8. And then Ivy with 22. Okay, bro. We're up against the Heat. No sweat. They didn't even draft anyone good. We beat them. We're up against the Magic. And the Magic, of course, we saw had Yao Ming, who is only 82. And Elton Brand, who's up to 87. He averaged 14 and 11. We're good, bro. Sweep them real quick. Oh, down 3-1. What? 3-2. They beat us 4-2. Damn. Paolo, Markel, and Yao Ming. They beat us. This dude, Paolo and Markel, with 22 assists. Yeah, and they make more threes. Are we not making threes? Cade went 9 for 15 from three. What are you talking about? Yeah, that's weird. Well, we blew that. And the Jazz can go all the way. Nah. Grizzlies and Magic. And the Grizzlies win it. So no one that's drafted yet has won a ring. You're number three, let's go. Now we're talking. AD's a 92, Ivy's a 90. I wanna see this happen. I wanna see Ivy become this good and Cade. Okay, so if we do the power ranking, there's no way that we're not first. Yeah, we're first. But now let's take a quick look. It's year three. Let's see if any of these uh, drafted players have became a beast yet. So far, LeBron's 94. He's the best drafted player. Um, This is other Zion. Tim Duck is a 93. He's doing good in this era. And then AD. So yeah, we have we drafted one of the best players. We we did we did good here. Let's go. Let's, let's try to go 82 and 0 one of these seasons. I doubt it's ever gonna happen. Someone commented the other day, like every video now is an 82 and 0 challenge, and I feel it. It really feels like that too. In this season, we're gonna have an even better record. Can we get 69 wins? 69 and 13, and our boy Cade wins MVP. Iron sharpens iron, bro. So AD is helping him become even better. 29 and 11 assists. Um, Cole Anthony, six man, Tim Duncan, DPOY. All right, so Cade, all NBA first team, and the Hornets have two of their players all NBA first team. That's tough. And then AD is nowhere to be found, but it's all good because this season he averaged 24 and 10. Great season. I do want to see the league leaders though. Edwards averaging 31, so is LaMelo, and LeBron. LeBron's averaging 38 and 8, and LaMelo's averaging 31 and 11. They're somehow only the fifth seed. Tough scene. Round one, we take that easily. Up against the Magic, sweep them easily. The Cavaliers, they're always pretty good by this time, and they they are, yup, 95-94. We are also really good too. We swept them as well. And we're up against the Thunder. The Thunder, don't forget, they drafted some good players. They drafted Cade Cunningham and Zion Williamson. Ah, they have a very deep team. This might go to seven. Let's see, man. Game one, we take it. 2-0, 3-0, and Boom, we swept him. We did it. Year number three, we swept him. And K wins Bounds MVP. Check the stats. He had 39. Davis had 35 and 10. Then Kate had 43. Ivy and Davis both had 28. And then uh, Davis had 12 and 8. And finished it off with 24. That's, that's a W, bro. It only took three years and we do it. Let's keep on going. Next year, we got this, this squad together, bro. Only 22 years old for Davis. Um, and is he the, is he a top power forward in the league? Um, no, no, it goes Giannis, Evan Mobley, 2K loves Evan Mobley, bro. 2K has high hopes for Evan Mobley, I noticed, and then also Darius Garland, like, like low-key, like on their nuts type beat, like really, really high hopes for him. Um, Allen Iverson is really good. He's averaging 23 and 8. The Jazz are doing their thing over there. I kind of want to see more of the Jazz because they had a great draft. They got Steph Curry. Allen Iverson, Ben Simmons, and DeAndre Ayton. Yo, and they still have Harden who's falling off, but still. And then the Hornets got Paolo. Bro, Paolo went to the Charlotte Hornets now. Yeah, East is stacked, and we finish off. Bro, we are, the Pistons have, high, bro, 2K is high hopes for the Pistons, and we won MVP. Bro, is it, is it, now I have a question, be real with me, bro. Is it, am I actually just a smart, like, drafter? Like, I drafted correctly in this video. 
even like the last draft video I drafted, the CPU did it, but it was correct. Or is, is 2K biased towards me because I'm controlling the Pistons? I feel like I've been crushing it every video with like success, and there's and something's up for sure. It shouldn't be this easy. Both Cade and AD are all NBA first team. Like we're 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 insane. We're crazy. Cade averaged 28 and 10. Ivy with 24. Claxton, okay. Gary Trent Jr. putting up 12 for us. We lost Jalen Duran, but this is our year. Back to back. No one's gonna stop us. Who's gonna stop us? Who's gonna stop us, man? We're up against the Thunder again. And we lost. Oh, shit. Damn. Well, game one, we uh, had that. Um, Cade Cunningham, funny enough, ended up taking us down. It'd be your own people sometimes. Yeah. And Shea Gilgis. We won that by two. Lost by 40, huh? 40. Zion had 35. Dang. Then we lost by 11. Then we lost by four. Shea had 51 points, and he missed three shots out of 22. Yeah, man. That's embarrassing. They, it was still a good year for us. Let's, let's keep going. I definitely drafted like a genius, bro. AD, AD always has high potential in 2K, especially that injuries are off. 297 overall guys that are huge. Yeah, bro. Yeah, our bench is decent, nothing crazy, but it, we can make it work with these two. Who's the best player in the league right now, currently? Tatum. Tatum and Giannis is, yo, Giannis, wait. Giannis is 32 years old in the year of, what year are we in? 2020. How old is Giannis right now? Bro, Giannis is only 28 years old right now. That's crazy. He has like 10 more years. I did not realize Giannis is that young. That's crazy. Wow. Yeah, bro. League's in trouble. Especially if he gets like real help, it's over. Luca's back. <clears throat> My voice now. Luca's back is MVP. Ming Yu Yi. Nah, that's gotta be racist. There's no way that that's a real name. That's not a real person, bro. Ming Yu Yi is not a real person. He's not even Asian, he's white. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, he looks a bit like, I would say like Italian, maybe, not Asian. Yeah, but Ming Yu Yi is not a real name. There's no way. Yeah, it's not a real person. There's no way. Y'all aren't gonna tell me I don't know ball. I know ball. That's not a real person. All right, but anyway, uh, Davis once again here. And we are now the third seed. Oh, what happened? Philadelphia 16 22, Charlotte 56 and 26. But however, somehow they are. What? They're the second seed and we're not? How's that make sense? 2K? They must have won more division games. No, uh, okay, that makes no sense, bro. We literally did better than them on everything, but road record? Yeah, that's gotta be, yeah, that's weird, okay. We end up getting swept in the first round, what the hell? Bro, Tim Duncan and Tyrese Halliburton swept us. That's crazy, yeah. And so the Hornets lost too. So who's going all the way? The Thunder and 76ers and the Thunder win it with Zion. So Zion's a beast over in OKC. Whoa, 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 someone got shot up. Now we have some trouble. Cade left, bro. Cade left us. AD signed to a four year, $200 million deal. And we have Jaden Ivey and Kelly Oubre. So where did Cade Cunningham go? That's what we need the answer to. We went to the Heat. Mm, that's tough. I don't know if AD and Jaden can, can get us that far, but let's see. Yeah, man, like I, I kind of pre predicted it correctly. I can't talk, predicted it correctly. Antoine Smith, who the hell is Antoine Smith? Uh, not a real person, okay, okay. Yo, I don't see any, yeah, just LeBron is the only one still relevant. He's yet to win an MVP, oddly enough, but he's averaging crazy numbers. Yeah, this is bad, man. Cade is a beast, uh, so is Davis, but we missed the playoffs. There's no playing anymore either. We're out of luck. <laughs> yeah, simulate playoffs here. And will the Thunder win it? Will the 76ers win it? Uh, the Clippers win it. Oh, oh yeah, he went. To, he went back to. Uh, he went back to the Clippers. What? A lot of people don't know this, but he got drafted by the Clippers back in the day, so he's coming back home basically. Yo, where did all the players go? You know, I feel like everyone kind of got lost in translation. Kyrie's a 94 overall, but I want to see who are the best players right now. Cade, Art. So we drafted the best player because this Cade Cunningham was was not in our draft class. This is the other one. This is the, the previous one. So we drafted the best individual player, and then it goes to LeBron, then Derrick Rose at 97. He's putting up crazy numbers, 26 and 11. And then Tim Duncan is doing well in this era, 21 and 10. Allen Iverson, 21. Individually, we drafted correctly, but you know, one ring is not enough. I'm trying to, I'm trying to win a couple more. And now Zion wins MVP, but he's putting up disgustingly good numbers, 33 and 13. That's crazy for Zion. Yo, maybe if he stays healthy and actually plays, he could put up those numbers. I don't know though. Elton Brand, Defensive Player of the Year. It's a new face, 28 and 14. I'm surprised guys like him are, are doing well in this era where it's a lot of shooting. Um, 
But we are the third seed now, so we did better. AD's 98. Yo, last season he averaged 32 and 14 without Cade. But now that John Collins is on the team, he took some points away. Yeah, I want to see Davis drop like 40, 40 a game. Round one against the Celtics, we end up losing that. LeBron's yet to win a ring. Maybe here he can win it. Yeah. Up against the Thunder. Let's see if the Thunder can take him. Thunder, yeah, the Thunder are just so OP. And hold on now. Game one, Zion had 47. Then he had 40. Then he had 17. 50 points. And 35. And finished it off with 34. Bro, it's insane. Yeah, the Thunder are just good. They're going to dominate the future, man. It's 2030. Let's do like four more years and see if we can, you know, if we don't, if there's nothing going for us, then we'll end it. But four more years and we have to win one more ring. Or go to the finals at least. All right, well, we ended up losing AD in free agency. So the year is 2020-33. So it's been a 10-year sim. And let's recap what has happened. Uh, LeBron ends up being the best player in the league, of course. And so is Zion Williamson. So he ends up being, these are the top two players that were drafted. This is old Cade. Um, then we have Anthony Davis, who went to the Bucks, And then other Cade Cunningham's 97 overall. Derrick Rose, Allen Iverson become good. Tim Duncan. And there's some other players I want to see, bro. There's like 30 of them. Like Kyrie Irving. He ended up averaging pretty good. He had one year, he averaged 32. How did Kenyon Martin do? Kenyon Martin, he put up a good 20 and 7 reads consistently. Dwight Howard capped off at a 90 overall. And he's doing decent. Yao Ming, 89 overall. Putting up during his career 17 and 8. Chris Webber, I think he won Rookie of the Year. Yeah, he won Rookie of the Year. But he only averages 14 and 10. And then Greg Oden. How did Greg Oden's career pan out with no injuries? He was still not that good. Tough scene, man. But uh, yeah, that was interesting. We ended up winning one ring. AD won MVP. LeBron won MVP. He won a chip as well. But uh, yeah, that's what would happen if we put the last 30 picks in one draft class. The, the LeBron is still the greatest of all time. It's crazy. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, man. If you did, drop a like, subscribe to the channel. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow, man. Peace.